Basic Introduction to Manual Programming Hi everyone! This video will help you learn about manual programming. After connecting the robot to your device via Bluetooth, click the Programming button on the home page, and then select Manual Programming. This will take you to Challenge Mode, Challenge Mode will help new users quickly learn about manual programming. Click Create Your Work in the upper right-hand corner to enter manual programming. The 3D model on the left will mirror the recorded actions of the real robot. A series of boxes to record your customized actions and five programming buttons are located on the right. Each box can record one action. Next, let's learn about manual programming by designing an arms wide open animation. Click the Start button below the 3D model to start programming mode and begin designing your animation. Raise the robot's arms parallel to each other. Click the Read button and then click the first box to record this first action. Open the robot's arms. Click the Read button and then click the second box to record this second action. Click Play to see an animation of the recorded actions. The robot only opened its arms once. Let's repeat this action a few more times by using the copy function of manual programming. Click on the first action and then click on the third box to copy the action. Similarly, click on the second action and then click on the fourth box to copy. We will copy more actions in the same manner. Click play again. You can see the robot's arms open four times. Continue to copy more actions. After the initial 16 action boxes are filled, you can add more boxes by scrolling up and down. There's no limit to the number of action boxes you can create. To delete an action, just click on the action box. An icon of a trash can will appear. Delete the action by clicking the trash can. You can also add music to synchronize with your animation. Click the Music button to enter the Music Function interface. Select the music track you like and then click the Add button in the upper right hand corner. There is a Recording function included in the Music interface. Turn on the recording function. Enter the name of the recording file and then click Microphone to record. After recording, click the Add button to pair the recorded sound with the animation. Click the Save button to save your completed animation to the Action Library. When you want to use this animation again, click the Load button. Enter the Action Library and click the desired animation to play it. OK, this completes our tutorial. Please contact us via email if you have any questions. See you next lesson. Bye!